Dr. Rogers here from Complete Care Animal Hospital. I'm kind of doing a little selfie video today because uh, it's late, all my technicians left, so they're headed home, but I wanted to share with you guys an interesting case of something that we saw today. So we had a barn kitty came in with some acute lameness on her right front forelimb. And when we palpated it, there was some instability there. So certainly when we do that, we always want to make sure that there is not a fracture or dislocation or something like that. Oftentimes when we have lameness with barn kitties, most of the time, honestly, it's bite wounds that we'll see because they're fighting, they're getting abscesses. So that's usually our go-to. But with this kid, there was actually a dislocation. So I'm going to show you the x-rays here. Okay, so this is a lateral view of her um, right forelimb. So here we've got her radius and her ulna, and then this is the distal end of her humus, and here's where the elbow is. So you can see that this is not in this nice little groove where it's supposed to be. Um, so there's no fractures, and the nice thing is that oftentimes uh, we can pop this back in. The key is if we can get this uh, popped in quickly, um, we're, we're farther ahead of the game. So what we did was we anesthetized this kitty and we used a little what I kind of call kitty magic or kitty love, some dexmedetomidine, some ketamine, some butorphanol because we just need some really good sedation um, and we need some really good relaxation because we got to pop this in. So we can manipulate it and um, we do what's called a closed fixation, pop this elbow back in here and then this way um, this kitty uh, is should be weight bearing and go home tomorrow. So it's important that you get to these as soon as possible because we start to get some contracture of the muscles and some things like that. And that bone is happier where it's meant to be. So probably this kitty got her leg caught in something um, and it just popped that elbow right out of there. So let me show you the after picture now. So here's our after picture and we can see that this elbow is nice and in its little home. When I flex it, she's got really nice, good range of motion. Um, and I also took, just to make sure, um, we took an AP view. So this is the left elbow, this is the right elbow. I just wanted to again, make sure everything was in there nice um, the way it should and it is. So this girl is waking up now and she will go home hopefully tomorrow. And of course, these things always seem to happen in the evening or on a weekend or something like that. So we saw these owners on an emergency basis today. I've never seen um, this kitty before, um, but you know, she's um, they were you know willing to do the things for her, and um, she's she's happy waking up. So let me show her to you. So this is our sweet girl. She's waking up from anesthesia. She's got a little bit of a ketamine high. This is this leg, but now she's got really nice range of motion. She's not painful anymore. Um, and this moves nice and smoothly. So she's gonna continue to enjoy her medicines, waking up from anesthesia. We'll get you home tomorrow, baby girl, okay? Good girl.